Hello, hate you all, 6 six. I apologize for the headset. I can't get the audio on my camera to work, so uh, if this is a little bit loud, because for some reason it's coming up loud on my computer, then sorry in advance. I'm responding to your video in which you asked the question, what is the definition of atheism? What is an atheist? Or some junk and whatever. <laughs> um, I've had a few too many cups of coffee today, so if I'm a little loopy, you know why. Um, my interpretation of the, of the term atheism, lack of belief, um, well, there are people who grow up whose parents never really indoctrinated them or brought them to church or temple or what have you, um, not having any specific belief. Um, that's kind, in my book, this is just my interpretation, in my book that's kind of atheism, as in they were never really shown a belief system. Um, atheism, as far as most atheists that I talk to and I have met in my daily interactions with, um, consciously do not or no longer believe in any deity or any religious system whatsoever. ever. It is different from agnosticism, my understanding of agnosticism as not sure if there's something out there. There might be, there's some interesting stories that suggest it, but no real concrete, you know, it's a nice thought, but I gotta take all this into account, and wait, what about, you know, all this other crap. My understanding of atheism is consciously deciding, based on evidence, based on experience, that there is no god, or gods. Um, that's my understanding of it. Um, an atheist, as far as I know, well, I've met so many, <laughs> you know, I've met atheists that are open to the possibility that there could be a god, and I've met atheists who are down to the core, there is no god, there is nothing supernatural or mysterious to the universe, it's all balls of burning gas out in the sky somewhere. And I've met atheists who are possible, who are open to the possibility that ghosts might exist. Um, yeah, um, like I call myself Wiccan, but I don't believe in an external, any external, uh, all-powerful, floating off in an alternate reality gods or goddesses. Um, I see the gods and goddesses as my own personal interpretations based on the different mythologies that I've read, I've, uh, more psychological, psycho-spiritual aspects of reality instead of all-powerful out somewhere in an alternate dimension. That's, that's not my interpretation. My interpretation um, varies very differently from what most other Wiccans believe. So naturally, I can only expect that every atheist interprets the concept that there is no God differently than another. So I hope <laughs> my very highly caffeinated answer is satisfactory, and please keep making more videos, and you have yourself a great day. Bye now.